A couple of troubling things about this case, of course, is the amount of the money was over $126,000. Now, this is not tax money. This is money that had been placed in the commissioner's account after property had been sold. And I suspect that a lot of these were airship type lawsuits that it could not be determined who was supposed to get the money. And so the commissioner is supposed to hold it until the distribution is made to these lost heirs. I'm troubled by why did he not keep a closer eye on these accounts, frankly? Why did he not keep a closer eye on these checks? And why did he not discover that 75 checks have been forged over a more than a one year period? Uh, I don't know the answers to that, but it is troubling that because he did not catch this in time, the amount of money lost out of his office is over $100,000.